Sam Hartman to wait for his quarterback, and he's going to be sacked back inside the 20. James Skowski, the senior, brings him down. He's been very up and down, trying to find his confidence here as the offense trying to find its footing. Shipley out a week ago against Connecticut. And a big run straight ahead. Broke through the line of scrimmage. Stopped at the 49 by J.J. Roberts. That's a gain of 17. He has been really the lone bright spot for this Clemson offense. Time for the on to the lay. Pass caught. Collins has it. And another first down. That's Bo Collins, a freshman from L.A. B.T. Potter. 14 of 18 on this season. This attempt from 50. And Potter, plenty of leg strength. Drills it right through. Clemson on the board first, 3 0. His mobility certainly in question. Surveys, backside pressure. Somehow escapes. And a deep heave. Collins is there. Brought in inside the 10. It'll be first down and goal. Oh, my goodness. Allen in motion, fourth down and goal. Handoff, Shipley for the touchdown. From North Carolina, Will Shipley getting it done. It's not that surprising knowing that he's dealing with an injury to that finger. Pace, running back, straight ahead. Ball pops out. And that's what Wake Forest does. They've been doing it all season long. 14 different defenders have created turnovers. Jasir Taylor did it right there for the Deeks. Clover, South Carolina. 23-yard effort. And he has been rock solid this year in Winston-Salem. No E.J. Williams. No Justin Ross. Ingata is out. Will Taylor is out. You wonder if they should just stick to the ground game. And then Davis Allen says hello and another first down. Power formation. Now Uyangalale comes out. Shipley the jump pass. Allen in zone! And he got it! Penalty marker is down. Let's check the infraction. Beautiful spiral by Will Shipley. I say that tongue in cheek because, my goodness, the thing's end over end. Look at this. I mean, that is amazing. That's like when you're 150 yards out and you're hitting the nice, easy seven iron. Obviously recognize the pressure was coming. They had to dump it. Hartman. Roberson turns around, makes the catch. It'll be first down and goal. Working against Makuba that time. And wake in business. Clemson just ran. That would be juicy. <laughs> Turner. Right side for the touchdown. And a big play for Wake Forest. The Deeks. And Dave Clawson right back in it. This is a great run here by Christian Turner. Just lowering his shoulder and finishing forward because that was well defended. I mean, there were two Clemson defenders that were right there. But man, they're hanging in there and they're battling and trying to get through it. Time for Uli under the leg. Pass is going to be intercepted off the bounce. And the Deeks force their second turnover of this first half. Expect an out route to the top or something like that to the boundary. Hartman with time. Heaves it. Morin. And was it intercepted? Andrew Booth comes away with it. Now Hartman's thrown five picks in his last two games. The first this afternoon. And that'll thwart another potential Wake Forest scoring drive. Great play by Booth. I mean, turning around, making a play on the football, just an unbelievable play there by the corner. Thing of beauty on the sideline. Into the second quarter. Clemson has it. Shipley, all kinds of real estate. Will Shipley into Wake Forest territory. Still on his feet. Stopped at the 37 by Red. But a good start for the Tigers' offense in a gain of 41. And a really nice run sequence from the Tigers. Their gain of 18. Uwe Andale lost the football. He tried to toss it to Pace. Bothroy blew that play up. Turner, the running back. He'll get the call on first down. Ball pops out. Tigers get it back. 
Balin Spector with a fumble recovery. Back-to-back -back plays with turnovers. With this defense on their heels, expect more of the same from Clemson's offense. On first down, pace, end zone. Did he get there? Yes, he did. Touchdown! Kobe Pace with a flex and Clemson back in front by two scores. You can see the Wake Forest defense trying to make a play. Masterson, number 12, shoots inside and there's nobody home. Tigers show pressure. Kern wants to throw it and he will. Pass is caught and how about that? A.T. Perry and there he goes. Perry off to the races. Sent out near the 12-yard line by Makuba. 31-yard field goal attempt, Nick Skiba. 17 of 19 this season. And make it 18 of 20. The number 84, that's the direction I want to look. It looks like he's going to get some man coverage. That's six catches so far today. Uwe Angelale heaves it deep. Wake Forest, Terry Torn is brought in. Collins has it. Penalty marker down, but that's a Clemson touchdown. Bo Collins reaching Pater. How about the catch by Bo Collins? One hand drops it in the bucket. It's a perfect throw from DJ Uwe Angelale. And Wake Forest coaches all week said we cannot give up the big play. This team is still very explosive. Diggs get it back, Hartman dropped the football, and who's got it? Wake Forest coming unglued on the road. Tyler Davis comes out of there with it. Pace, 129 rushing yards already, and one touchdown. He'll get the call here, make it two! Great job there by the right side of the offensive line. Walker Parks, number 64, the right tackle. Securing the edge. And it is again. Cooling. Into the end zone for the Wake Forest touchdown. How about the drive and determination by number 28? Number 28. You're going to see pressure. All-out pressure from Clemson, but look at the offensive line. I mean, just absolutely destroys Skalski. That's Devontae Gordon, the right tackle. Man, they're never boring, that's for sure. 35-yard field goal attempt from B.T. Potter. Splits the uprights. But the Heisman race, far from over. I think I heard Matt Barrett 1.17 for 18 was Stroud. How about the catch by Roberson of the one-handed variety, and it's first down in goal Wake Forest. How about that catch? Hartman directing traffic, floats it, and it's caught Whitehart. Second touchdown grab of the season for number 85. And just barely squeezes it in there. Very tight coverage. As you can see, Wiggins collapsing. And the handoff straight ahead goes Turner, and he got there. 41-27, Christian Turner with a two-point conversion. So be careful with a little sandwich game. You know they'll be up for SMU, you know they'll be up for Houston. Big play, Kobe Pace. Pace, the stiff arm. Pace, pylon. And stop just short. Talk about the determination, the effort, the hustle. DJ's missed some throws, but he's also made some nice throws, and the run game has been superb. Deep handoff, Shipley towards the goal line. And the late signal is there for the touchdown. His second rushing score of the day. He also threw for another touchdown. And the Tigers seizing control once more. It looked like he was there initially, but I believe he was on the back of a defender. And as he was, never down there, obviously, extends the ball across the plane. Good awareness there by the freshman. Adversity is this Clemson team's had to experience with injuries and ups and downs. The fact that they're still alive in the ACC is remarkable. And it's a testament to their players for hanging in there and continuing to battle. 48-27, to 27, the final score.
Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+.